I'm Johnny Ocha. Welcome to my world. Yeah. Welcome to my channel. I'm Johnny Ocha. Is that my real name? Of course it's not. What is this YouTube channel about? Simply, it's about me and my life in my world. So let me give you some background about me. I'm a 41-year-old man. I'm living in the U.S. I was born in Croatia, which is a tiny little country in Europe. Maybe I'll put a video of Croatia right now for you to enjoy for a second. I'm sure my accent can be heard from a mile away. Maybe I'm the next Arnold. I'll probably not though. So, I'm a husband to a loving wife and a father to two beautiful kids. My kids are a little bit younger and they're one of the many reasons, but one of the main reasons for me to start this YouTube channel. If any of you have little children, you know that today's generation is completely glued to their devices. They're glued to the iPads, tablets, phones, everything. I see my kids watching YouTube quite a bit and they watch this kind of, I call it stupid videos that does absolutely nothing for them and they learn nothing from it. So I want to start a channel where I can have something that maybe in the future they will choose to watch and maybe they choose to learn from it. Right now, when I speak with my children, they simply do not understand a lot of the things I want to tell them. But, you know, I was thinking to myself, what can I do to capture this moment, to capture myself? So I decided if I create so-called digital legacy of me, maybe one day they'll be able to understand their dad and who I was at this point in my life. See, unexpected things can happen. I mean, especially in my 40s right now, unexpected things can happen with your health and everything else. In case something ever happens to me, I want to make sure I leave something behind. Outside, you know, like a picture or people talking about their dad, or blah, 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 where they can hear from their dad for themselves and learn something from me. As I got older, I was not able to talk to my dad much. I wish I had a chance to learn from him more when I was younger. When I was younger, my dad and I just had, you know, casual conversations and never anything really deep about, about life, about what I should be doing, all the other things that are very important in one's life. And I'm, luckily, my dad is still alive. He's elderly. But again, because he's older, it's sometimes a little bit difficult to have a meaningful conversation. And that's something I kind of missed out on when I was younger. So, doing this channel will allow me to simply capture myself at this moment so I can be seen again. Besides my own children, others might find this information valuable, you know, since other YouTube channels talk about kind of specific things, but very few of them have really combined kind of all I would say all, which is kind of hard to say, but a lot of life experiences all in one channel, right? Because you got channels that about do just fitness, some do nutrition, some do scrocks, some do education, some do retirement, some do cars. I mean, it's kind of hard to find somebody that does everything. Is it possible? <laughs> Who knows? Is it worth trying? Hell yeah, it is. You know, there used to be a YouTuber that I found extremely entertaining and motivating for me in the past, right? His name was Rich Piana. He was the guy that did 5% nutrition, kind of bodybuilder. He very well spoken guy, very entertaining. And kind of gave him some inspiration. Maybe, you know, I can try to do the same thing as he did. But he was more focused on bodybuilding. Am I a bodybuilder? No. Am I ever going to be a bodybuilder? No. Because for me, it's not worth it. 
my health is not worth sacrificing having, you know, like huge, you know, muscles, you know, walking around 250 pounds, all that stuff. If I'm overstressing my heart and I could, you know, potentially shorten my life. We were lost rich in 2017 and I was really heartbroken to see that. And, you know, it is what it is. It's a life lesson. You got to take care of yourself. So what I plan to discuss is everything. So the backdrop of this channel, what I'm hoping to do is going to be my fitness working out is something I call my obsession. It's my obsession because I want to stay fit. I don't want to get big. So I will talk about my successes, struggles, further goals, and having this type of channel is going to push me to be better at what I've been doing. So lately, I'm kind of focused more on longevity. I was saying unexpected things can happen in life, health stuff, you know, as you get older, my you know, blood pressure goes up, cholesterol goes up, all this stuff goes up, and that will shorten your life. So how do you live longer, right? I've been learning a lot about longevity lately. I mean, lately is more like last five years or so. So I'm trying to figure out how can I prove my health and be better physically and mentally than most people in the 40s to excel and push my body to be better every day as for as long as I can. Right now, as I said, in my 40s, I'm more aware of my mortality. For example, like in the food that you spend really good money on, you go anywhere, you spend $10, $15 for lunch or whatnot, all that food is designed to kill you. It's shit, total shit. It's something I'll discuss in later videos. But see, that's something I want my kids to be aware of. My kids love McDonald's. They love banchan chicken. If you guys don't know banchan, it's double fried Korean chicken. Does it taste good? Hell yeah. Is it good for you? No, it's terrible. What I essentially consider life is what I call impossible balance. By being responsible for a million different things and not being able to do everything 100% that you want to. I, I have a job. I work nine to five. I try to train four to five times a week. I have a wife who I love very, very much. And my, my children keep me very, very busy. Maintaining a house, car, finances, and a shitload of other things keeps a person quite busy. Time is one of the most precious things and, you know, there's not a lot to go around, especially as you get older. Having that free time for you to do what you want to do gets shorter, 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 and shorter. See, sometimes, sometimes, <laughs> I'm also guilty of just kind of wasting my time on stupid shit. In a way, having a YouTube channel might push me and motivate myself to be more productive, more efficient, and move even further in the right direction. Considering everything that I do, unlike other YouTubers who might just, you know, run a YouTube channel, I think this might be a challenging endeavor. Can I do it? Who knows? Will I fail? Maybe. But you know what? At least I tried. Important is, get off your ass and try to do something. You know, that's kind of like, I'm here in my basement gym. Is it fancy? Nah, not really. It's, I mean, I like it for what it is, but it's nothing crazy. But I'm still going to push. Still going to try to create some content. Still trying to entertain. Trying to have some fun. I'm going to tell you how. Try to live like a normal person in the society. How to make the best of what you got. It's how to be better. How to better yourself. You cannot go from here to here in a second it takes time gradual improvement i think the japanese call it the kaizen if i my memory serves correctly having this channel will hopefully make me try to become a little bit smarter try to become a better, little better speaker you know try to memorize all this dialogue in my head <laughs> it ain't fucking easy <laughs> your brain jumps all over the place so We'll see how that goes. 
I want to just put together a normal person's perspective. And I really hope you, my children especially, will learn something from your dad. And hopefully the rest of you guys might be entertained along the way. This initial video is a test. See how it goes. Production is all done by myself. Editing by myself. Filming by myself. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. But you know what? I'm glad you're here. Welcome you again to my world. Let's do this. So today for the first video, outside the introduction, we're going to do some back and biceps. As I call biceps, the most important glamour muscle of them all. <laughs> all right, let's go to the workout.
right, so we just killed back, killed the biceps. I feel good. I have my little shake. Now it's time to finish up, and I'll see you guys next time.